Hey everybody, this is Robin from TayloredEdges.com uh, and the podcast. I wanted to show you an example of something I was talking about in one of my recent blog posts called Stick It in the Right Hole. So you guys, um, Stick It in the Right Hole is about how to button a three button jacket or just how to button a jacket in general. And a lot of people think that because there's three buttons that you're supposed to button at least the top two of them. That's not always true. So the, there's a rule that we go by. Um, and that's why I called it stick it in the right hole and it's called sometimes oh I should probably show you this okay if there's three buttons on a suit see if there's three buttons on the suit damn there's two buttons on that one this is not going well I'll be right back Okay, this is actually a suit that I made for one of my clients. Don't tell him that I put it on. Yet. Okay, damn, it's still two buttons. Okay, so anyway, <clears throat> if there's three buttons, the rule of thumb is to go down and say sometimes, always, this is always and then never. So basically, you never close the bottom button unless, of course, it's a one button suit. The top button, which this one doesn't have because it's not a three button, that's optional. It really does depend on how the suit looks on your body with that button closed. But please don't assume that because it's there that it's intended to be closed. Sometimes the way suits are made is that even though they're made with three buttons, the top button, the designer never intended for you to close it like this. So really you have to do a visual check to see how that suit looks best on you. So remember it's sometimes, always, and then never. Okay so this is Robin Walker host of Tailored Edges. I should probably get back in my picture. <laughs> One second. Don't tell him about his suit. Okay, so this is Robin Walker, host of Tailored Edges. Make sure that you listen to Tailored Edges on iTunes and make sure you go to my blog, tailorededges.com.